was NIH consulted about removing the Bayh-Dole safeguards from the contracts? We were not asked about that. We've been asked about those safeguards in other circumstances. Do you support inclusion of those safeguards to protect American people from price gouging after we in invest in the development of drugs? I certainly think the American people ought to have access to vaccines that they're helping to pay for, and I think the plan has been nicely made to be sure that that is the case so that nobody would be denied access to this regardless of their health care coverage. The margin rights issue actually are rather complicated. When you look at the original language of Bayh-Dole, it does seem, as Dr. Dispro said earlier, that these were intended to try to allow the government to step in when there was a company that basically refused to try to produce a product that would benefit the public. It does not look as if those particular parts of the bill were intended to do something where the price was considered to be unacceptable. We've been caught in this many times before, and that's what the lawyers tell me. So in this circumstance, I have to defer to BARDA in terms of why the decision was made, but my understanding was there was really no likelihood that the product wasn't going to be pursued, in which case March in rights would be a tough thing to try to apply. In which case it would be okay to leave them in the contract. Moderna contract still has those March in rights, and NIH claims joint ownership of the Moderna vaccine. So I find it interesting that NIH wasn't consulted over the difference between that contract and some of these other contracts. I have to be careful here because it's possible somebody at NIH was consulted, but I was not made aware of it. So uh, I'll have to check on that and see if there was a consultation. Yeah, thank you. And Dr. Redfield, uh, was the CDC consulted over the uh, elimination of this contract language and in, in designed to ensure uh, fair pricing? Not to my knowledge, sir. Okay, thank you.